Welcome to another vlog. So I decided I wanted to keep vlogging, but I'm probably gonna vlog only once a month. It's just gonna be a smattering of things happening throughout the month. Today is a Saturday, so Rachel and I have decided that we want to go visit. I have to get this mirror in here <laughs> so I can start getting ready. She discovered a new um, coffee place that is that is supposed to be pretty yummy so we're going to go see it i need my glasses hold on i want to try this nyx plump right back this is plumping serum plus primer very much a gel i'm not going to do a lot of makeup because it's saturday and i don't know i don't know even why i'm bothering i'm going to be wearing a hat one of my viewers asked me if i would um, do a video where I would talk about how I clean all of my makeup products, not just obviously brushes. You guys have seen how I clean my brushes, but everything else, because they do need to be cleaned periodically. I mean, let's look at this. I mean, that's really kind of disgusting. <laughs> so it does need to be cleaned. And this will get, this is a mascara or a a lash comb and it's my absolute favorite find at least for tools for putting makeup on this is one of my favorite finds that i got i got it on amazon i'll link it below but it does need to be cleaned periodically because it can fill with mascara and then it doesn't work anymore maybe later today i'll clean some things okay so this <laughs> i changed my clothes and i have this new hat i think it's so cute it's got shirt sh what's it called Sharing Sherpa. <laughs> I don't know what it's called, but it's so cute. It's fuzzy. And oh my, I'm in the sun. Okay. So I changed my sweater too because it didn't go with the one I was wearing. But I just think this is a cute hat. I love wearing hats on the weekend. Bitch, is it cold out? <sighs> Wow, that's so cool looking. <laughs> it's cold out. Rachel and I just got back and we went to. Sephora and Ulta, so I thought I'd show you what we got. So some of this is Rachel's and some of this is mine. I got these tweezer man. I thought I really need these because look how near, like pointy they are. I thought, yeah, that'd be really good for me. Because sometimes you know how you get those little ones and you're just like, I can't even grab it. So I thought maybe that would be better. The It Cosmetics Superhero No Tug shadow stick. I'm trying a whole bunch of shadow things, mostly for a video. So this is in the color Transformative Taupe. So it's just a, a stick, it's really neutral. It is a matte, it's not shimmery at all. And I'm trying to find the perfect ones that won't crease. So I can't wait to try that. Then I got Bye Bye Under Eye. I'm gonna try that one. Concealer, Rachel got the caffeine solution from The Ordinary for her eyes. And then my favorite face tanning is Tanologist and I get the medium. Love this stuff, that's definitely a refill. Now Sephora. I wanted to try the Tarte Tinted Maracuja. I've heard good things about this for, for actually quite some time. So I thought I'm gonna try it. And then I got the Laura Mercier Caviar Stick in Caramel. So it's the, kind of the same thing as the, the lid all over color. Rachel got from, I think this is Fenty Beauty. Yes, Fenty Beauty. Um, it is a cream blush. Rose Latte is the color. Oh my, that's very dark. But Rachel tans, so... That looks very pretty though. Oh, she hasn't touched it, so I want to touch it, but I won't because it's hers. So she will, she'll do the initial on that. So we went and got our coffee and Rachel got some avocado toast at that place. It's called Dirt and it was okay. It's plant-based. I'd never had oat milk in a latte and I actually was kind of like not looking forward to it. Once I realized it was all plant-based place, I'm like, oh, I really want a normal latte. But I gotta actually say, I liked the oat milk latte. So I don't know, I didn't really miss the fact that it wasn't milk. That's it, those are the things I got. It's not bad, once again. 
Rachel got her diploma. Yay! It's not in any like packaging and stuff. No, it's but, not like when you walk. But, but when that's I walk, exciting. Congratulations. Think that do it? Yeah. They'll give you a folder and stuff okay, for it. Because this is like not protected at all. No. Congratulations, my Rachie. Thank you. <laughs> Look what I got. Yay! I'm so excited, Rachel and I decided we would save. Okay, let's just be clear. This is more me <laughs> saving all my points from Ulta to be able to buy this. So this is normally around $500, which is crazy expensive. And I would not want to spend that much, but I had a ton of points um, because I have their credit card. I put Rachel's school bill on the credit card, which I pay every month. So there's no interest or anything. And I got this for only 200. So if you're don't have any clue what this is. This is the Dyson um, Air Wrap. Oh, what is the name of it? Dyson Air Wrap Complete. That's the name of it. I can't wait to try it. So I thought I would try it on this vlog. I don't want to give it a full review. Oh, I'm so hot. I don't want to give it a full, like, complete video because it's been done so many times. So I don't need to add to the clutter of all that. But I thought you might be interested in knowing what I think about it. Now, I have not used it at all. I have no clue. I shouldn't say that. I did turn it on when I got it and did one little air wrap, but <laughs> I have not tested this in any way to know how I feel. But oh my goodness, it does have quite the cord. It's pretty long. Oh boy, I would not say my hair is smooth at all. In fact, it looks like a frizz ball. Okay, I've sectioned out my hair. Just got a tiny, but tiny bit of dampness in it. There we go. Okay, I can't even tell you the last time I had a curl that curled from the root all the way out like that just doesn't happen feels cool so i'm gonna just run my fingers through it okay i've not looked at the back i feel like the back has spots that didn't get curled you know what i mean do you see that all right i've had it on just enough to do my makeup so probably i ha had it on i've had it curled so probably about a half hour it did take away frizz i love how the frizz is gone i'm sorry you can see i have a mess behind <laughs> realize that it's really fun to play with takes a little bit of time like more time than I would want to do my hair so Doug and I are going out to lunch I'm very excited so we're gonna go well first we're going to Best Buy to buy a new printer because ours has bit the dust I hate printers they're so annoying and the ink we had the one we had before the ink ran out almost immediately so we're like done. We're like, we're not buying anymore. So we just want a plain black printer. I can always get a color printer done at school and just pay for it. So there's no point having us a printer here. So we are going to lunch at Benihana, Japanese steakhouse. I love Japanese steakhouse, like love. So I'm so excited about that. My hair is still holding up okay. Obviously it's only been like an hour since I did it, but, um, We'll see how long it lasts. Okay, I actually like today's hair better. And I think it's because when I was done, I used a wide tooth comb to go ahead and comb it through. Okay, I just realized, yes, I am wearing the same sweater two days in a row. Because <laughs> nobody saw me yesterday. So, um, and I wanted to show you something. Oh, these shoes. Oh just so cute casual but look I mean come on exact same color so I mean yeah they're just so cute actually I think I got them at Nordstrom Rack but they give me a little bit of a lift and I'll show you what they look like on so see how it's it look looks cute on I think it looks cute on so and then it matches my shirt and in case you're wondering, on my face, I'm using the beautiful 
I'm still trying to get used to it. I still think it's finicky. I truly do think this is finicky. I, in fact, I can see little white dots here and this is a good color for me. So boy, yeah, still thinking what I thought on the video. Uh, my lips, I am wearing Laura Geller's lip liner in Happy Hazelnut is on my lips. And then over that is um, Glowing from Charlotte Tilbury. My blush is Liss and it is the color Confident. Love this. It's a cream. Love this. Essence Lash Princess Waterproof for my mascara. And my eyes, I used Ulta Beauties, Vintage Beauty for right on my eyelid. And then above my crease, I used the same one, but in Game Over, but just a really natural look. So we are on our way to church and I'm excited because Rachel's boyfriend, Mike, is going to meet us there. Ryan's playing. Um, so Rachel's driving with him. Well, made Rachel's driving with Mike. <laughs> Ryan's already at church because he's playing up on the worship team. And then afterwards, we're meeting my friends, Karen and Kathy. You guys met them in Vlogmas for Thanksgiving and for Christmas. No, Christmas they weren't with us because one of them had COVID. So we're meeting them at a Mexican restaurant after church. So it'll be really fun for our whole family to be together. I got my first ever box called Living Better 50 for women with spirit. <laughs> com. I got it on Amazon. So it looks like this, the box. I wanted to see if it was worth it because it's not a cheap box. So during Vlogmas, I told you guys that I had been trying the Allure Beauty Box and I did it for about six months and then I canceled it only because it was a ton of skincare. And there's just so much skincare I can use. I mean, there was some good makeup products, which was fun, but I really didn't, I don't know, it wasn't enough. So it wasn't worth it to me. It was cheaper than this one, but I thought I would open this with you guys. It says the value of it is $125. Okay, can I just say, I hate these things. All it does is create a mess to me, in my opinion. And then my cat thinks it's so much fun to play with them. All right, first thing I see is a rose-infused exfoliating bath glove. Rose-infused. It's worth $5. I wonder if this has a strong rose smell. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. What is this? Love forever. At this moment, the heart is racing and a love for the family has begun. What? Okay, it looks like that. I'm not going to lie. It kind of looks like a memorial. <laughs> oh, it's a necklace. All right. I mean, I can't wear it because I'm allergic to everything. <laughs> Metal. It says it's worth $50. It doesn't say anything about it, like if it, what it's made of or anything. Maybe I'll give it to Rachel because she can wear almost anything. It is pretty. So that is pretty, but Right? Doesn't it look like a memorial? <laughs> body butter, eight fluid ounces body butter with antioxidants, reduce inflammation and deep moisturizing. It's in a very plain box. I can't even get out of the box. Oh, it's so slippery. Like I think it leaked a bit. It's in there. I can't, I can't get it out. It is literally looks like it's a candle. It's that thick. Wow. I feel like I'm putting actual butter on my arm. There's no smell to this. Well, that's interesting. I'll have to see if I like that in the long run. It says it's antioxidant shea butter, grapeseed oil, soy wax, cetyl alcohol, ruibus tea, frankincense oil, clay, sage oil oil. This is $20. Two more things. This is called Flesh Hot Sauce Lip Gloss for saucy lips with a glossy shine. This tube of gorgeousness holds a sensuous, comfortable, non, not gummy texture. Mmm. <laughs> that's what it literally says. $20. Actually, that's a really pretty color. It might be too light on me. Oh, it's just a real lip gloss. 
Okay, I like that. It's pretty. I'm glad about that. I think is a perfume. It's wrapped up <laughs> very securely. Literally, I don't know how I'm going to get it open. I don't know why they say that this is for 50 plus. <laughs> I literally cannot get this out. Our Aroma Daughters Collection Eau de Parfume. Eau de. Hmm, not sure if I like that. We'll see. And it says that one is $15. So it's five things. Actually, I kind of like it. I think. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> I'm a hard sell on perfumes. But that was fun. I will let you guys know as I go along whether I think this box is worth the money. I'm pretty sure it was like 40 something. And I'm pretty sure FabFitFun is around the same price. And I feel like you get a lot more with FabFitFun. Rachel and I are on our way to like, how many places do we have, Rach? Like five. Five different places. So it's Sunday afternoon and we have to go to Sephora and we have to go to Target and we have to go to Ulta, Owen oh, Costco. Mm -hmm. And some of this is just plain returns. I should get those sneakers from Costco, Rach, the white oh, ones. Yeah. So we're going to go get some things done and I think we're going to go to Sephora first and then there's this, I know this is bad, it's carbs, but there's this pizza place next to it called Jules Pizza and I am telling you it is the best pizza. It's really thin crust, really thin crust and they have very unique toppings. It's not like a pizza joint. It's I don't know. I don't know how to describe. It's kind of gourmet-ish, but it's not uppity gourmet-ish. It's a decent price. So we're going to go there. So we thought we would take you along. All right. I want to buy one of these. Uh-oh, Rachel, which one was it? <laughs> Stink. I think it was this one or maybe that one. One of these was my color. And the, cho the question is, should I get it at Ulta or get it at Sephora? This is one of our favorite places. This is a really fun shop near us. Oh, Sephora's down there. And then we go here and Jules Thin Crust Pizza. Oh, yummy. Nope. Okay, I got the Kim's. So it's barbecue sauce with chicken and some mushrooms. I don't even like mushrooms. For some reason, I like it on this. Rach, what'd you get? Uh, I don't really know. <laughs> Rachel doesn't know, but it's pretty. Yeah. Become a mechanic. Apparently, that's in. <laughs> I remember wearing things like this in high school. Okay, this is cute. That's an extra, extra large. Now, let me see what the large looks like. Okay, that is so cute. Should I get it? I'm gonna ask Rachie what she thinks. Look at the collars, cute. What about blue? That's a medium. Medium looks pretty big. Oh, medium, definitely. Oh, that's so cute, and I like the blue. Rachie, I was thinking about getting this. Hey, you will. <laughs> My grandmother knit this afghan. <laughs> Ooh, my heart. Okay, that's cute, Rach. That'd be so cute on you. With Wait, do you see like your back? No. Not really, just it ties. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's so cute. Yeah. Rachel thinks I would like this, but here's the problem. They all are short. Well, this one's not so short. It's actually kind of cute, but I'd feel very bright. Now I'm gonna wear a quilt. I'd wear that. You'd wear that, Rachie, the bright red, or no pink? Oh, I saw this last time and I really like it. What is it? It's oh, just silk pants, pants? And then you put it with the top. They look like pajamas. Yeah, exactly. It's a trend. Oh. You wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. No. So true. I would not know. It's like a good one, too. I like that, but it, you'd have to be very specific about no, what you wear. No, you can wear just wear with black it. or tan. Oh, that's true. Black. Yeah, you're right. That's cute. That's so cute. I have this one and I like it. Yeah. Well, I got it off of Amazon, not here. Yeah. Look at it. Do you have Look more? Look how good I've... those are. I know. They give you a ton. For how much, though? 12 pack for nine bucks. I don't know. I've never tried this. I'm sure they're good. 
I like Very black. Very long. I like know. Like it's a long blade. I don't know if I like long blades. Do you have mm. more of those clips that aren't supposed to crease your hair? Yes. Can I have them? <laughs> Sure. I need to use mine. I'm going to get my hair cut. I'm so excited. I get my hair cut at Alta. I found a lady I love there. I'm also returning. Do you see it? <laughs> the air wrap. I decided to return the Dyson air, air wrap. Here's the reason. First, of course, it's very expensive. Now I used points, but still, it's still expensive. And there's still points that I use. So I have to love this thing. And I just don't. It takes way too long to curl my hair. And then the curls don't last. Like if I curl my hair with a curling iron, it lasts for days. I think on the other, the air wrap, it would unwrap in like, or uncurl like in two hours. So I, I'm sorry, that's way too much time, way too much money. So I am picking up the new T3 Air something. I don't know. I actually saw it on Angie Hot and Flashy and I thought, you know what? I'm gonna try that and see if I like that. And, cause the part of the um, Dyson that I liked was the actual round brush. And I also cannot wait to get my hair cut and colored. It's just, this is just too brassy. And I, I wanna do like an in-between. Like this is my hair color, obviously, but I'm hoping she would be willing to maybe put a color in between my hair color and the highlight. Does that make sense? I don't know, we'll see. I will show you the after when I am done. Hopefully I'll like it. <laughs> All right, hair is done. Kathy did her thing again and I like it. I'm not liking particularly how she styled it. It's a little too much in my face, you know what I mean? but I like it. She did highlights and lowlights and she colored in my roots so that I have no gray and then she just trimmed it. I'm trying to grow out a little bit, get a little bit longer. So I actually do like the color a lot. All right, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I, we are on our way to church. Let me give you the look. Hello, Richie. Hello. <laughs> There's my hubby. Hello, Doug. <laughs> he hates it when I do that. All right, guys, I hope you have a good one. I'll see you in the next one. God bless.